Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome back to Frostpunk and the Arcs. We're on day number 13, and our seed arcs are defrosting quite nicely. We'll be ready in time for dinner. Um, however, we are in researching improved heaters, so that when they do thaw out and they're perfectly ready for dinner, we'll be able to refreeze them. <laughs> God, I am chatting a load of crap. Right, everything's freezing, everything's on scrap, and we go back up in temperature tomorrow. Wow, really? Really? Even with improved heaters? God damn. Damn. That's extreme. What's up? Frightened patient. One of the one of our people is facing death, but he's still refusing amputation. He keeps screaming that he doesn't want anyone to touch his leg, and he won't change his mind, even though the gangrene will kill him in a matter of hours. Cut off his leg. He'll thank you once you've done it. What's going on here? Losing a limb. One of our people has done amputation. Working in freezing cold has left him with frost, severe frostbite. There was no other choice. God damn it. Uh, we actually have a factory, don't we? Yes. So we can actually make... Uh... You mean... Ah, uh, oh, I don't know. Consider signing something we've already signed. I like it. Do you know, I've also noticed one thing. Is that uh, because of the way my audio is set up on my computer, I can have audio playing that doesn't come across on my recording and uh, quite often I will actually record to music just I'm not really listening to it but I just have it on in the background and uh, so yeah I'm currently playing Frostpunk with uh, 80s and 90s rock music going on in the background I, I, I mean life doesn't get much better than this <laughs> It honestly doesn't. I'm playing a game I love, listening to music I love, recording a YouTube video. I don't see how life could be better. I really don't. Right. We've literally just got to wait until tomorrow for the temperature to go up and then we'll be absolutely fine. Yeah, well, there's not much I can do about that, is there? What do we actually need? It's so long since I've played the arcs. It's like a week. Maybe even more since I've played. What do we actually need? We don't need coal. We don't need wood because we're getting that. We don't need... We've got a steelworks going. What do we actually need? We've got loads of rations. Because our uh, pothouses are doing bloody brilliantly. Gee, so let's save the coal on those. We can at least keep them a little bit warm. Even though it's not actually doing anything. Um, I don't know anything that we can actually research. Oh! That's what we need to research, the um, actual coal mining, not the thumpers. That's what we need to research, because we need to have tools maintenance in the coal industry, which we can't do with thumpers. That's what we need to do. Scouts have arrived. What have they arrived at? The South Pass. Oh, yeah, the, the place I sent them to because it was almost freezing to look for steam cores, which are not there. The new prospects. Traversing the narrow pass while avoiding the falling rocks and small avalanches was perilous, but we managed to get through. The observations made from the pass revealed some s revealed several sites in the area worth exploring. Lone Boulder, the, yeah, but the, they're, they're going to be frozen by the time we get to them. So, go to Misty Valley. That's the other option for steam cores. And momentarily, it's going to heat up. I don't know that that goes any... Oh no, it does. Okay. We need the heater on to uh, to warm them up. Are they going back up? I can't tell. Oh yeah, it is going back up slowly. It's going back up, it's going back up slowly. Right, let's get a bunch of people on there. Let's do some of that. Yeah, I'm not... <laughs> Figuring the distance. So we've noticed something in the distance. A small black dot in the white desert moving slowly towards us. It might possibly be a survivor. Okay. Yep, survivors. Uh, one day, 
bones. They're not actually going to get there. I can't. They're not going to get there in time. They'll have reached the city before the guys even get there. So that is useless. Now, directly after I record a video on the art, I'm going to go and record a video on the refugees. In doing so, I hope I can put out a refugees and an arcs video on the same day. The only reason I didn't with the first refugees video is because I ran out of time in the day that I was editing them to finish editing them. Right. That can be dismantled, please. And we can make a coal mine. Right, those are slowly heating up. Or what do you want? A note of thanks. Oh, no problem. You're welcome. Card families to properly care for uh, in, an invalid. Places like this make it easier for us. You are more than welcome. I forgot I had even built that, but you know. Okay, so we need three prosthetics. We need a three prosthetics, please. Thank you, Shun. Uh, you are currently researching absolutely now. So. Let's use you in other places. You have loads of food going. You're fine. Let's put you on there while we're working out what we're doing. Uh, Research-wise, what do I need? Two automations in the coal industry. One in the steel. One in the raw food industry. So automations can work on that. That's fine. So we just need to build automatons. Um, how many do we have? One there. One there. We just have two. I think we might just have two. So we need to build another three. Oh no. Going to... You're going to build that. You are doing something. I'm not entirely sure what. <laughs> I can't remember where I've put people. Uh, you, mm. Right, come off of that. Okay, so we have three, so we need to build another two. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. We have three, we need to build another two. Okay. Why didn't I build that inside the circle? That's so stupid. Why I'm, I'm confused why these aren't being dismantled. Um... That's fine, because I'm going to build bunk houses. There we go. That's... I don't know why I, bought, I built it on the outside. Maybe I was expecting more people than I actually had. Oh. Uh, right, put an automaton on that. Those are nearly... Uh, um... Refro... No. Those are nearly unfrozen. Those are nearly defrosted. Perfect. Right. What do we want to do next? I don't really need to do that, if I'm honest. We need to reduce the price of automatons. They are so damn expensive. They are so, so damn expensive. Right, what do we need to build more cams? We need more steel. Automaton, go and function. Do 2.2. That'll be a perfect screenshot of my thumbnail. Thank you very much. <laughs> Cry for help. So an exhausted man has just reached our city, badly frostbitten with a harrowing story to tell. He says he's come from a nearby city called New Manchester. It's most it's mo it's had I can't read. It's inhabited mostly by workers and their families, but their resources are running out and they're in trouble. Well, fearing the coming storm, they sent a scout team to look for help. He's a sole survivor. He begs us to help his people. We must find out more. How far away are they? Not far at all. Okay. Is it worth diverting? Well, they haven't frozen yet. We've only got 14 hours to go. So let's go. Let's carry on from there. And then we will send him onwards once he's been to there. 
That works. Right, what was I doing? I was... We're doing steel. Coal mine's fine. Wood doesn't need to function because we have tons of it. I'm tempted to make a second steel. That's expensive, are they? 25 wood. Which we have metric arse tons of. Let's make a second one and we'll put an automaton on it. Helping at what cost? Uh, some of our people are restless. They argue that with the storm coming in, we won't be able to succeed in our mission to help and help New Manchester at the same time. It's I understand it's a difficult decision, but they want to know your priority will be. What your priority will be when? What? They want to know what your priority will be when we have to choose. Oh, I won't endanger our mission. Our mission is still at the core, but if we can help people out as well, then we're going to do that. That's a lot of resources, damn. I didn't realise he had that many. But we have we have a ton of stuff, so why would we not? What are you doing? Oh, no, 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 no. Off that. Come off that. We need to be producing steel constantly. And we're going to fail that challenge. Wonderful. Yep. Thank you very much for that. Failed that as well. Lovely. Just what I wanted. Okay, head on to the expedition camp. Go. Actually, would you be better off coming back? Come back, dump off your stuff, you'll be faster without it. He says, probably, maybe, possibly, I don't know. But I don't want to lose all the stuff we've just dumped. See, I completed you what you requested, just like 12 hours too late. <laughs> right, how many more people do we need? That need prosthetics. None. So what are you complaining about? <laughs> Do the upgrade. Oh crap. Uh, are we gonna have enough space? Let's have a look. I can't remember where the thing is that I need to look at. So, yes, we have more than enough. Perfect. We won't lose a single piece. Awesome. Thank you very much. Right. Get your asses to that place. Let's go. We have one on there. One on there. One on there. We shouldn't have because we should be... Oh, no, we don't even need it now, do we? Nice. Okay, just stay on there. So we need two more. Build away. Oh, bugger, yeah, you need steam cores, don't you? I forgot about that. We don't have any. <laughs> oh, crap. Are any of these things steam cores? They're not dumps. God damn it. Maybe New, Ham maybe New Manchester has some steam cores. Who knows? Because you can't build them. As far as I'm aware, you can't build them. Right, we are on day 17. However, we're only at like 20 minutes of recording, so I'm going to carry on. Fallen Heroes, we found the bodies of the other New Manchester Expedition members. Their supplies are completely insufficient for this weather. This, that, that one of them managed to reach our city is from here, beggar's belief. Right oh. Get going as fast as you can. Uh, I don't know if I can do some stuff to help you. I probably should do some stuff to help you. Make you a little bit faster. Might keep you alive. Who knows? We'll find out. Right, right to drop temperature again. Minus 50. Brace yourselves. Old is coming. Perfect. Right. I would like to do the cheaper automatons, but honestly, there's no point at the moment because we can't even make them. Unless we get more steam cores. We can make them. 
Right. We might as well max out on everything. We might as well max out on resources. Uh, going to go and automate in that. And let's just make some food. Let's just make some food. What's going on? Messenger lives, Captain. We've managed to treat the messenger from New Hampshire. New Hampshire? Why don't I keep calling it New Hampshire? New Manchester. It's made a full recovery. Thank you. If I'd been in New Manchester, I'd have died. We don't have the means to try to set that such deep frostbite. His city seems to be dangerously undeveloped. Can you at least tell us where it is? So we can go straight there? That would be very, very helpful. You know, just point it out on the map. <laughs> right. Does anyone need cross aesthetics? No, no one does. Everyone is simply in treatment. Wonderful. Give them gents faster sleds and then we'll do the cheaper... Uh, we will do as the cheaper uh, automatons. Two hours to go. Boom. Steam cores. Yes. Suicide mission. This vehicle belonged to the members of the expedition from New Manchester. It's clearly too heavy for the ice and it rode over using it. Here it was pure suicide. Observation tower supplied. Depot discovered and one steam core. God damn it. We need another one. Rusty shack, nothing can be seen from this distance. Tall wooden tower, no movement can be seen around it. Uh, that's too close to the storm for my liking. We're gonna go there. It's, it's, mm, that might have a steam core, but I'm not willing to risk it. Let's just go towards New Manchester. Follow Zive. Oh, where's the... Where am I drilling overtime? There you go. We are no longer taking in overtime. You can be happy now. You're still cold at home. Yes, well, live with it. <laughs> That's all I can say. You're chilly. I wonder if I can actually... Uh, that requires that. And I guess we can do the house. I guess that's the thing. No point in doing the infirmary because it needs steam cores. We don't have any. Trees are full. Wonderful. We can jump off of that. Wrap up well. The boss is here. Okay. Get to work. It's only a day we can survive that. People, it's only a day we can survive that. Right. Let's do the houses and then uh, we can do. Um, do the houses and then once we get once we know we have more steam cores and the guys coming back we'll start doing the cheaper automatons and such and I suppose we can do the hot house installation we'll do do the house and then we'll do the hot house installation we will do it in that order because at the moment we are using coal or things that do not matter. There you go, make the uh, prosthetic. Some kind of temporary observation point, we have a better view of what's ahead of us from the top of it. Right, so, we can now, we can see New Manchester, many strands of smoke rise can be, s many strands of smoke rise can be, I'm not sure that's English can be seen rising from it, which means it's still inhabited. We have to reach them as soon as possible. Yes, we do indeed. Go, 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 go. It's only going to take a little now. See you there. Very nice indeed. And I would suggest... I would suggest that we bring them back here, is what I would suggest. And in the morning, we're going to start making food again. They have arrived at New Manchester, a dying city, a dimly glowing generator stands in the middle of a shanty town. There are so many people, too many, they look sick, un 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 underfed, oh underfed, <laughs> I was way way over reading that, holy crap, <laughs> and most of them don't have proper roof over their heads. Nothing can save them from the storm except us. Uh, we will try to help them. 
Yep, we're going to try and help them. Uh, right. Don't see what the stone ship is. Aim for New Manchester. We found New Manchester, but its people are lacking almost everything they need to survive. We can try and help them, but only automatons will be able to carry supplies across the windswept wasteland to them. If we want to help them survive the storm, first they will need construction material, steel, wood, build shelters. That is just the beginning. They will need much more, especially food and coal. I mean, I think we can do that. Gather 600 steel, 600 wood, and one automaton and send relief. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I think we can probably do that. We do, actually. We need to make a couple of resource depots. If we're going to actually stock up on the amount of stuff that we actually need. Hey! Get to a functioning. Because we need to make a hell of a lot of food. How many are we taking care of? Okay, seven. Okay, not awful, not awful. Houses complete, wonderful. Um, did we want to do the hot house? Actually, we've got quite a few days before anything happens. So, instead... Oh, that's frustrating. That is frustrating. Right, we're on day number 19. We've been recording for nearly half an hour. So... We have objectives of continuing to make our automatons, which are expensive as hell. And we don't have enough steam cores to do it anyway. We're bringing back one, so it means we can make one more automaton. Um, we've got eight days left to do it. I genuinely don't know how we're going to do that. Oh no, that's going to the stone ship. I might go to Spy Depot just to see if it's got enough. To see if it has actually got any steam cores. Because we need them badly. We really, really need them badly. And then we have to start making supplies for New Manchester. I'm going to try my best to make supplies for them. But we have to remember our goal of keeping our seedling arcs alive. As always, ladies and gents, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for the support. And I'll see you in the next episode.